Hello again, this is uh, Brian Mayock, aka Darth Yoda. Uh, just uh, bringing up a, a recent game I had in uh, StarCraft 2. I was uh, pushing for a Zealot Rush. Um, it's going to speed up the camera here a bit just to show my build. Um, I exchanged pleasantries with the uh, opponent. You know, good luck, have fun, good luck, good luck. Um, but uh, getting some pylons off early and I got uh, warped in the uh, gateways and he was scouting my base with a probe there but I was able to chase him away but he, he saw that I was probably getting ready for a, a zealot rush uh, I got a, um, a cannon uh, base off just to set up a perimeter I sent out my uh, three zealots just to see what was out there and start gathering in front of this base. Let's speed things up here a bit. Just continuing to build and making sure I didn't reach supply cap early on. He, uh, okay, so there I went in for the zealot rush. Wasn't very. Um, didn't really catch him unawares, he already had some uh, stalkers ready, but uh, I fought through the stalkers and then his probes were just getting knocked out. I started to overwhelm him here, and uh, I mean, the, the probes, they're meant to collect uh, minerals, really not meant to fend off attacks, but uh, that rush, I was able to score some hits on his economy and uh, now we enter the next phase of the game um, I, think I was trying to get off a couple of, oh, I, I built a stargate uh, I wanted to get an expo off just to ensure that um, I had more minerals for my economy and I started pumping out um, some air units here I built an oracle uh, just to, so I can start scouting and hitting his economy um, behind his defenses. Oracles are pretty good. I mean, they can do several things. They can act as uh, detectors, and uh, they're only um, air to ground. Uh, they are not air to air type units. So effective for uh, fast scouting and hitting ground, easy ground targets. Here I got off a uh, second oracle. I discovered his expo. Um, he had a um, an observer here trying to see what I was doing. I also had an observer, so I was able to uh, destroy his uh, tricky trickiness by spying on me here. We meet our fate. By now, I'm starting to harass his second expo with uh, my oracle. Then I start pumping out some void rays here, and he, um, you know, you should really try and defend your supply line, uh, either with a simple cannon, the enemy has discovered or at least us. some anti-air units. But um, I am here in the shadows. He, he did not, so I was exploiting that advantage. I'm going to speed things up here a bit. I'm uh, developing my economy on my second expo. I was sending units to defend it here. We started to gather, um, you know, having a differ, uh, differentiating your your units ensures that you have some sort of tactical advantage over your opponent at some point. Uh, so best not to just have one type of unit, you know, you want to have a, a mixture of units. Um, so I started uh, bringing in, uh, uh, I started meeting stalkers, he knew I was coming. And I just hit his expo, and I just start pumping in units over there. I think I was I was able to to take that expo out. No, no, I wasn't. He uh, came in with his units. Um, I uh, was overwhelmed at that point, and I was gonna go for a de uh, the Dark Templar. So I, you see me building the um, the buildings to achieve that uh, tech tree. I'm going to speed things up here again. I, I knew he was coming, so I started building cannons. 
prismatic core. Sending my void rays to protect my expo. I was trying to get another expo off, but uh, he discovered that. He was warping in units with his uh, airship there. Uh, he was heavy on the mortal unit, which is not uh, anti-air. I mean, it's good ground to ground. It's kind of like a tank, but uh, ineffective against the void rays. And so that's where I was able to exploit the, the air advantage on him and um, overwhelm his uh, stalkers and anti-air defenses. So I just kept on pumping out Void Rays, um, so that was the unit to go with. Uh, I did have extra minerals that I wanted to uh, utilize, you know, try and keep your minerals under 100. Uh, just, you know, you want to be able to have units to attack and counterattack with. So here, I'm, I'm on his front door at this point, and um, I, I'm starting to send some DTS in, some Dark Templars in a moment. Um, but let's see if he leaves the game at this point, and uh, that was a victory for me, Darth Yoda. And I'm just cleaning up his base and having a little fun at this point. From the shadows I come.